Ya hapa Nairobi ni kwamba idara ya usajili wa watu imeratibiwa kuongoza katika visa vya ufisadi humu nchini. Katika ripoti iliyotolewa na tume ya kupambana na ufisadi EACC idara hiyo inayohusu masuala ya kuwasajili wanaozaliwa na wanaofariki imeratibiwa kuwa asilimia tisa huku hospitali za umma zikichukua nafasi ya pili katika kukithiri kwa ufisadi. Idara ya usajili wa watu imekabiliwa na kashfa ya kuadhulumu na kuatisha watu kuitisha watu mlungula katika siku za hivi karibuni huku wananchi wakilalamikia kukosa kuhudumiwa In terms of perceived most corrupt ministries or unethical ministries if you like the Ministry of Interior National Coordination was still leading by 47.5% and this probably is because they are also the basic unit of service delivery and Kenyans interact with them at all levels. In terms of largest average bribe per service, you can see that uh, obtaining a tender attracted the largest average bribe by 88,294 followed by seeking employment at 23,344. Seeking of government funds, lobbying for government funding is uh, 22,283. We are calling on all Kenyans to support the fight against corruption. We are also calling for continued support of the government and the development partners to support the war on corruption. We want to see that corruption cases have timelines so that a case does not go on until all the witnesses die and then uh, it becomes not interesting at all and therefore we are uh, put, uh, asking the lawmakers to put this into law we are also uh, stepping aside we are also asking that a law be made for officers to step aside state officers to, to step aside when under investigations or charged for corruption. We are happy that this has happened by a ruling from the court, and that's a celebration. Uh, we want this to be affirmed in our law.